Hey, screeners, how you doing? It's me, the one AJ, Anthony Jordan. And me, Nico Nero, and you're joining us for another classic movie review. AJ, what's the show about? Right, guys, so what we're looking at is traveling through the decades. We're going back, sometimes way back, sometimes way, way back, back into time. And that's what it is. So what we're doing is we're taking the week that you're looking at. Not necessarily when you're watching it, it's YouTube, it's evergreen, right? But what we're doing is we're celebrating films that are celebrating a decade birthday. When I say a decade birthday, it's because we travel in 10s. We either do 10, we do 20, we do 30 or beyond. 10 could be a bit of a shocker. 20 and 30 to guys who are just approaching the big four row, one closer to it than the other. It's a bit of a kick in the you know where it's okay. But we, we still like to celebrate all this good or bad movies. So that's what we're doing. I have not a clue. So you guys are reading the title. I don't mind when we're at the point of recording it says TBT free. That's all I know. <laughs> that's as far as it goes, right? That's how much of a throwback I know. I just know we're traveling and from through this week. I don't cheat. I don't go into Google and be like, what was released at this time? <laughs> Sometimes you might see people celebrate something, but they're normally in the 25, 27, never in a decade. So right now I'm completely shocked. And Nico's about to reveal what film we are about to celebrate or trash the hell out of. Uh, well, I think it's a goodie. I th- I've brought it up before. I hope you've seen it. We're going back 20 years, AJ. Ooh, another kick in the Goonies. 20, okay. yeah. <laughs> 20 years. I don't know if you've seen this one, though. Really, really good poker movie called Jade. No, I do recall you bringing this up. Oh, good to see Sly. That's, uh, Sly, Gabriel Byrne, Tandy Newton, Jamie Foxx. It's got a serious cast that to it. Street? Not Street. Um, oh, God, what's her name? Oh gosh, Put, oh, the lady in the top left. I don't reckon she's not who you think she is. is who she are you not? thinking, Michelle Pfeiffer? No, 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 no. I know her name. I know her name. It is definitely who I'm thinking it is as well. Melanie Griffith, that's the one. You got it? Yeah, Melanie Griffith. Okay, kudos. I recognize her, but yeah. This is a really fun poker movie. And. Definitely in top 10 card movie, poker movie territory. Question. Do you have to be well au fait with poker to appreciate this film? (sighs) It's a really good question. Do you have to be... Do you have to be well informed in poker to watch Shade? I would say yes and no. I think you'll gain a better enjoyment out of the movie if you do know a bit about poker and the various hands but equally even if you're not a big poker person this isn't going to get lost in translation the 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 dramatic beats of what the movie's trying to achieve are going to be abundantly obvious at the core it's a group of people who are trying to work their way up the poker ranks and win a poker match against the dean and the dean is as per the poster sylvester stallone the the goat poker player right (laughs) and they go through stages of their poker journey in this movie you know jamie fox plays a really really important role and disappears off the face of the movie about halfway through you'll have to watch the movie to find out why but it's a really engaging story about double crossing about how to use poker as a yeah how to weaponize poker almost to achieve your ends and just about a group of people who, you know, whose own hubris gets ahead of them. If you want a movie about people who are really good at what they do, but they forget the cardinal rule, there's always a bigger fish out there. In this case, the fish happens to be quite big. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, man, it's it's it, Shade, I feel, is one of those movies that people really just haven't seen. Or in some cases, maybe not even heard of. It's 20 years old this week. And it really is one that I would say go and check out because Shade is good. Let's have a look at the trailer because I've not seen it. So I, I'm just waiting to be tempted by it, to be honest. Okay, let's check out the trailer. And here we go. How are you, Charlie Miller? Charlie Miller. Cool guy. Can I answer? You want to get a message to him? What about your crew? You so much as know your boss's history. Do you know what a mechanic I do that. He's, he's the mechanic. It is good to be back. 
You know, no one's here. Guys go all their lives trying to get into a game like this. They end up a winner every time. Are you our man? For sure. Let's pop this cherry, shall we, fellas? Jamie, you know, bitch never knew what hit it. You sure I had to pick a baby? That's what I'm here for. These last bitch certainly turned out to be profitable. It's the word on the game, is he saying? Yeah. He's young. He's He's this guy sat down with gangsters, killers, mobsters. You really think you can take Stevens? Don't get so cocky. He's never been taken. Not yet. You're in way over your head, Mr. Miller, and you don't even know it. Once the game is over, I'm out of here, and you and Charlie can go back to whatever it is you have going on. This is Mr. Stevens. Look how young he still is. I know, oh, that's mad. Right? Into little pieces, you won't even know it. Quit and he's still already got grey hair. That's really scary. Bad matters, Tony. Whoever takes the Dean, it comes. To me. You're not a hustler, are you? <laughs> okay, I'm in. Is it about the art or the money? As long as I'm around, you're always going to be second best. Don't bet on it, sweetheart. Quite a car. I mean, you're just here for the game. Oh, that's the game. It's cool, huh? Interesting. It does interest me. It's, do you know what? I have to say, having just rewatched that trailer, to go back to the question you had earlier, you probably do want to know quite a bit about poker. Because I saw the, a few of the cards and I was like, oh, I wish I knew, but like, I how do you sometimes know poker, like bro? The, the game of kings. Hey, I, I have one card game that I enjoy, and that's that's what I stick with. So, well, who <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's in a roundabout way. If I call it blackjack, there's there's going to be a debate over which version of blackjack it is. So I'm not going to get into that, but. Uh, 21 yeah no 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 this is the problem i have another one which is very much like uno a version of blackjack a two means pick up two a blackjack means you pick up five a queen means anything could go on to, yeah so like this is the way it goes so uh, it's, that's just the game i was taught and it's the way it's, that's just been the game uh we've you know if you, get, you bring up a stack of cards that's always been the one that people like mm. I've, we've always levitated to yeah don't get me wrong i enjoy a good game at 21 as well but yeah, token <laughs> just always eluded. Um, so where do, where do I score this? Where does this land on the on the awesome awesome o meter? One thumb. It's one okay. thumb. I don't think I don't think it's going to like alter anyone's movie going world, but it's it's definitely good enough to be seen, and it's original enough that it was it demands your attention, and it's putting some actors into a certain capacity that you may not expect. Notably from Sly Stallone. Um, yeah, man, like it, it especially if you're a poker aficionado, maybe add a half to that one, but even if you're not, so what it's a one thumb to be seen. Interesting. I mean, look, it, it there's no one in the cast that kind of turned me off. The 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 plot point seemed interesting. So mm. I would like to say I'd, you know, time permitting. It it didn't rock my world enough for me to be like, I'm gonna watch that tonight, but it did no. like okay. No, I will. I'll give that a shot. You know, uh, I could. Yeah, I'm done. I'm done to see it. Have you guys seen Shade? I want to hear from you all down in the comment section below. If you have, let me know and let me know what you thought of it. Um, recommend it to AJ if you agree that it's one that probably should be seen. Subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so already, and please do be sure to like the video and share it with anyone who's interested in kind of retro or classic reviews. But until next time, we'll. See you soon right here on the Silver Screen Dudes. Bye for now. See ya. See ya.